Yo, what's up everyone? It's Tony here and I'm back again with another video. So, uh, on today's video, uh, from the title you guys can tell, uh, these two I'm about showing you that are up to like so many of them, I can't even count them, are uh, these pro tools that are worth over $50,000. See, I'm not kidding, I'm not over exaggerating or anything. And uh, I'm going to show you exactly how to get these tools for free, for free okay so what are these tools let me uh the list of these tools let me just show you and these tools will blow your mind trust me uh first of all you have canva pro you will get access to free 12 month subscription canva pro you all know canva pro is what they killing people pay uh 12 dollars per month uh, and also 100 and something uh dollars per, uh, per year or 200 and something dollars per year just to get access to canva pro but with this method I'm about showing you you get canva pro for free then you also get one year uh, domain name registration on name chip for your website not just that you are going to get a hundred dollars uh, worth in platform credits for those that are using digital ocean then microsoft azure is another free tool you get you get up to free access to 25 uh microsoft azure, azure cloud surface services worth hundred dollars you know and this one is a free subscription for students annually like it's for jet brains name.com name also one year domain registration one year free advanced ssl and more that like these are uh, look, look at this let me keep on scrolling another tool that i'm i'm so 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 excited to show you that you have access to is Streamyard. Streamyard. if you all know if you want to stream if you, if you want to stream game if you want to organize seminars Streamyard is one of those uh tools and this tool is is free for you in this package okay free access to the essential plan an essential plan of stream yards cost about 49 dollars okay but for sorry uh 25 dollars per month okay so if you calculate that in one year you should know what i'm talking about here like it's worth much more than that and not just stream yard look at i'm still scrolling down you see there are so many of these tools look at this and stripe this is another tool stripe uh if you if you sign up using this particular uh, method i'm about showing you get access to waiver a transaction fee on your first one thousand dollars you are going to process through stripe i mean this is amazing so i'm not just gonna going to bore you with all the talk okay please make sure before i get started with this video make sure you subscribe make sure you subscribe to this video turn on the bell notification icon please leave a comment smash that like button so that uh youtube recommend more of my videos and a lot of persons will see this information have you done that have you have you subscribed yes okay i i, I know you have done that and smash the like button thank you so much and let's get started with this video okay so for all these uh tools i just showed you here all of these tools all of these tools so you can get access to this only if you're a student and there is what we call github student developer pack detail uh, student developer pack and this developer pack okay will give you access once you are approved on this platform called github and you are approved and verified that you are a student okay that's why they are giving you all these tools because they know you are in school you are a student and they assume that, that you are not that financially capable to take care of all these tools and they also want to help you be productive with all these tools all right you may, I may imagine canva pro and uh, name chip and all of those things all of those things so with this particular program called github student developer pack once you're a student that means you're 100 percent qualified for this to get all of these tools that are worth over fifty thousand dollars in value so uh for this github uh this uh student developer pack what do you need to get started man all you need to do all you need to get started is just your student email address okay email address that usually ends with dot edu okay something dot edu that your school gives you like your school any school maybe it's a university polytechnic or whatever school you are attending they normally give you an email address that ends with edu most especially the one that is related to the school website or school email okay so if you have a student email a valid student id i'm not just talking about university students if you are doing your masters if you are doing your phd you are a student okay and you are entitled to all of this gtop uh student developer pack so haven't qualified you have a, a student email then you have your valid your valid students 
ID, okay, student ID. Once you have these two uh, ready, so all you need to do is to go over to this. Way. I'll leave this link, this link here. I'll leave this link in the description. Please go over there and click on the link. I'm not getting it's not uh, yeah, an affiliate link, so just click on it and it will lead you to this particular page you are seeing right now so if you land on this page i'm going to take you through how to sign up how to get the student uh developer pack right now okay so just follow this process you see a green button here so click on sign up for student developer pack developer pack yeah 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 so okay so you have students teachers okay and just just so you know this the, the two benefits there are two different things uh for for uh, for students you have the JIT Pro, okay, you have valuable uh, student pack, you have uh, training, expert trainings and all of those things. For teachers, their own differs. So if you're a teacher, you can also try this out. There are so many free, like free GTOP, uh, GTOP team, uh, team for courses, coding clubs and non-profit research. Then there are so many free distance for teachers also, not just for students alone. But if you're a student, then please click on get student benefits. So once you click on get student benefits, what you want you want to do is you want to you are new to GitHub, right? You, are, you don't have a GitHub account, uh, so you need to create an account. So you, you click on create an account. So here, right here, you uh, they will ask you enter your email. So I'm just going to go to my school email i'm going to blow this part out okay i'm just gonna paste it and then click on continue let me do that right now uh just so you guys know please make sure you enter your dot edu dot in my own case i have dot edu dot ng so this is what my email ends with which is my education email so all i need to do is just to click on continue then the, i will be asked to set my password which i'm going to do right now uh okay so this password is strong so all i need to do is just to click on continue and uh my password is accepted so uh, they asked me to choose a a, a a username so i'm just gonna enter my username sorry username is not available so i'm, I'm going to just i'm just uh, going to try another username uh, I'm just gonna maybe add one to it okay so they say turn your boom one is available okay no let me use video guy let me use video guy I just pray this is available too it's not available wow video guy tony okay so video guy tony is my name here my username i'm i'm just gonna click on continue uh would you like to receive product updates type y for yes okay so i'm just gonna click on y which is yes and click on continue and then they will ask him please solve this puzzle to verify that you're a human yeah i'm a human so start puzzle so uh pick the matching cards wow uh matching cards six okay six six yeah one six okay uh seven next time pick the matching okay you know what just hold on i'm going to fast forward this part let me just solve this puzzle okay then i will uh, continue with this video okay so i'm done i'm done uh, solving the puzzle so all i need to do is click on create account okay, so it said we are almost done we we'll sent a launch code to my email so all i need to do is to go over to my email but copy that code and paste it here uh i'm going to cut that part out because i want to blow some things so i'm just gonna do that now and meet you guys on the other side okay so the moment you paste that uh code inside here you will see welcome to github okay so they will ask you, you know so many questions how many team members will you be working with uh i'll just uh, or are you a student or a teacher so i'm just gonna choose a student okay i'm a student so how many team members just uh, i'm just gonna choose just me just me and I, I will continue 
then they will ask me what tools will you need to build what you want uh what specific features are you interested in so basically just answer this uh collaborative automotive uh client apps project management team administration community and then click on continue and then uh unlimited public private repository it will lead you to this particular page and then you see uh this part which tells you free then you see another part which tells you get additional student benefits so this is where you want to click on okay so this is where you want to click on apply for student uh GTOP student benefits so you click here okay so we are back to this particular page where uh it says sign up for student developer pack so what you want to do is to click on here again make sure know that we have already signed up on so get students uh, benefits student benefits okay so uh, you see get your students uh, benefits get uh, pro why you students valuable this and valuable that to qualify just make sure you read uh, these instructions you must have a duty uh, account which I already have a verifiable school issued email or upload document that prove you are currently a uh, student status then offer available to our partners okay and blah 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 and blah okay so then you scroll down to this section I'll blow out some things okay I don't want uh, some part to show so I uh, already that email I signed up you can see it here something.edu.com it says what email address do you prefer to use for your school i'm going to choose that right now you choose it okay that's why i said please make sure that you used your student's email to sign up to github okay so then he said we require students using the uh, to send additional proof of academic status okay so this is where uh you need to you know apply upload your student id uh then under here what is the name of your school uh, it's it, it, it from your email this will automatically be loaded here they will see it that the name of the university so down here you are expected to tell them how do you plan to use github okay so it's just basically tell them uh type you know tell them whatever you need github or make it detailed okay tell them you're a student you need those tools to do designs blah 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 all those like make it's more like a pitch just just so you know you can apply for this and not get approved so please make sure you write this with due diligence write something nice and so that once they read it they will apply they will approve your application then this section where i talked about you require a uh, uh school issued email to send uh, uh school to send addition uh we require students using okay to send additional proof of academic status okay so more like a valid uh student id so just so you know so coming to this place i'm just going to write in your why what do i plan to use this for and then click on continue so i'm done writing whatever reason i need the github uh, student pack for so i'm just gonna click uh, uh once it's submitted so just make sure you verify all the details once i submit this you won't be able to edit it again so the the instruction is clear so i'm just gonna click on continue okay so right here this is where it gets interesting this is where they want to actually give access to students only so this is where you have to upload your proof of your academic status it can be your student id which is valid like it must be valid 2020 c2 okay it must be valid you have to upload it or another form of proof maybe your transcripts your trial or doesn't if you don't have any student id it doesn't include a date you can upload a letter of school letterhead or documentation with a date that demonstrates your current enrollment do you guys see it so this is just where you've got to you know click uh, click here take picture or upload an image either of these two okay then you come here and uh, select maybe official transcript enrollment letter to your school date of class schedule for the semester 
a dated syllable for a class, dated receipt from Bossa, dated scholarship. Uh, you know, there are so many proofs, things that not just student ID. Okay, there's other things that you can upload just to show that you're a student. So make sure you upload that there. Then after you are done uploading that, just make sure it's authentic and up to date. Then you click on process my application. And trust me, uh, this takes quite a while, but trust me, just keep on checking your mail. Once you are approved, once you, you are given access, uh, once you get in, once they give you access to this, you get access to all those tools you saw me mention that, that are worth over $50,000, both Canva Pro, StreamYard, and all of those things. There are so many of them which I can mention here. Okay, so I hope you guys got value with this. I'll, I'll end this video here. For sorry, sorry, this is for students. Okay, I'm sorry, but uh, I just have to share it with students. And make sure, please, share this video. There are a lot of students that don't know about this. I mean, students, please, all over the world, share this video. Share, share, like, comment, please, so that other students on YouTube all over the world get to watch this video and get access to this invaluable information. Thank you so much. And before I part ways with you, please, please be part of my channel. Subscribe. Okay. Turn on the bell notification. I'm, I'm trying to hit 10,000 subscribers. I know you can help me do that. Please and please do that for me before the year runs out. And uh, my name is Tony and I'm saying bye for now. I'll see you guys in the next video. A peace.